All right, I'm just gonna kind of go over what we can really quick, just to show you guys a little bit <clears throat> about this uh, this miner. I don't know if you're gonna be able to see the screen or not very well, but I'll, I'll move the camera closer um, as I kind of talk about some of this stuff. Uh, but basically what we have here is a sample mining board. This has one chip on it <clears throat> underneath this one heat sink uh, that is being run off of a Raspberry Pi uh, with Raspbian in the background. And what I have over here is the actual um, mining, uh, like the mining activity um, from command line. And then I have set up a sample slush pool account, which after the, um, after this demo records, I'm going to, uh, put the link to that, the read only link for the slush bowl account. So you can kind of look in and dig into the stats here. Um, but right now, I mean, you can't read it right now, but what we're running at right now on this chip is uh, 74.2 giga hash a second for just a single chip, um, which is pretty fast. Um, it's, uh, and this is still a sample. So if you've seen the PDF, um, that'll also be a link in the description. Uh, if you've seen that PDF, you know that uh, we have sample chips and we have mass production chips. So the mass production chips are still finishing uh, tape out. Um, but we are already putting the sample chips on full boards in machines, uh, which we will have tests uh, for those coming up as soon as we get the chance. Um, now, just to give you an idea, I'm going to kind of grab this camera, see if I can't. Like, you see what's going on here. So this is just kind of our board. And then now you're running at like 15 watts for that entire board. Um, about, you know, two watts um, to three watts, depending on, you know, what's going on is being used for just the board and the rest is all the chip power. Uh, I have this running in the updated mode uh, or the, the uh, turbo mode, which we're calling ludicrous mode at the moment. Um, so that is that is what's going on there. Um, <clears throat> we're we're really excited about this for about three weeks now. We've just been doing some tests and making sure it runs stable and that uh, everything is as we, as we say it is. We don't want to, uh, we're not trying to put out any uh, bad information or information that's blatantly untrue. So um, yeah, so everything, everything's been good. Um, you'll be able to go back um, over in the slush pool account and, uh, see the statistics for this chip because this chip is the only thing that's ever been running in this slush pool account. So you got some pretty accurate stats there about how fast the chip is and whatever. You will see some spikes and different uh, like levels at different times because this, this chip and the machine will actually have three different modes. We'll have an efficiency mode, a uh, standard mode and our turbo mode, which is ludicrous. And, uh, at its fastest speed, we're going to be running at 38 terahash. And at the slowest speed, uh, we will um, be running 15 terahash. Uh, power consumption at 15 terahash is 700 watts. Power consumption at 38 terahash is 32 to 3300 watts. Um, that's, that, and that is an estimation because we are not running that on a full board yet, but that's based off of per chip uh, power requirements. Um, the, everything is uh, pretty simple. I mean, I can, right now we're running at 75 giga hash, but I can actually come in here and I can turn this into an efficiency mode by basically going, turning this, you can see the watts change right here. It's at 15.2 right now. We're changing our uh, frequency to 200 megahertz at point three volts and we are running now at 5.8 5.7 watts for that board uh, and it's already it's already hashing it's already got uh, it's already got targets the last for the last five minutes since I mean since I just 
tuned it down. It's running at uh, about 60 giga hash a second. So it's, uh, so it's averaging down a little bit now that I've turned it into efficiency mode. Um, and yeah, so I'll, uh, I'll sit here and wait and see if there's anybody else. And if you don't, um, if you don't get to ask a question or if you don't get in on the live chat, uh, you can ask him, you can pop into the comments section. Um, we also, you can email me at Michael at aspismining.com uh, or sales at aspismining.com for uh, information. I'm going to switch this back to mode. <clears throat> I'm going to watch that power jump up in a second. There it goes. All right, um, I'm gonna sign off. Um, I'm gonna do another one of these next Tuesday as well. Um, if anybody has any questions, you can always email me, michael at aspismining.com or sales at aspismining.com and we can discuss uh, any questions that you have about this. Um, we just wanna just slowly trickle information out just so people know that we're continuing to uh, move forward with this project and we're excited about having it. Um, and it's actually kind of cool to think that that little Chip, you know, um, has more hashing power than some of the first ASICs come up on the network. So yeah, so I'm going to sign off now, and we will uh, we'll talk again soon.